Hello everybody, welcome to Anablox. We have some exciting things to talk about in this video. And the topic we're going to focus on today is the top 5 anime you didn't know had a live action adaptation. But of course, before we dive into this video, I've got a question for you. Have you subscribed to this channel yet? If you aren't, you're missing out on quite a lot here. So make sure to subscribe so that you will always get the latest information about anime from us. Anyways, like I said in the beginning, let's dive right into this video. Orange When Naho Nakamiya receives a letter from what appears to be her future self, she is naturally skeptical. However, when transfer student Kakeru Naruse appears in her class as predicted in the letter, Naho is forced to believe its contents. As she reads on through the touching letter filled with regrets, Naho discovers that their new friend, Kakeru, is no longer with them ten years later. Naho embarks on a journey to battle fate and save Kakeru's life. The manga and anime series are relatively well known and have received a lot of positive feedback from the anime community. It is frequently lauded as a realistic attempt to address the complex issues of mental health and suicide. Many Orange fans may be unaware that the series has a live-action film adaptation with the same name, which was released in 2015. It also received the 39th Japan Academy Prize in 2016. Your Lie in April Kusei Arima is regarded as a child prodigy in piano, routinely winning competitions and playing so flawlessly that he is dubbed the human metronome. However, after his sick mother who had been his strict piano teacher up to this point dies, Kusei is unable to hear the sound of his own piano. After two years of going about his life in monotony unable to play the piano, Kusei has a chance encounter with the free-spirited violinist. Kayori Miyazaki, who brings color back into his world. This poetic, bittersweet musical exploration of youth is only enhanced when the music is performed. This is also why the anime adaptation of the series has become as popular, if not more so than the original manga. The live-action adaptation debuted in 2016 and finished third in its first weekend. Assassination Classroom Class 3E, a class of delinquents and dropouts with no hope of academic advancement, is housed in a specific classroom tucked away in the depths of the mountains, at the elite and hierarchical Kanugikawa Middle School. That is, until they are assigned to the task of assassinating their teacher, Koru Sensei, an octopus-like monster who created a massive hole in the moon and plans to do the same to Earth in a year. Surprisingly, Koro Sensei is also the best teacher Class 3E has ever had. Due to the potential limitations and difficulties in achieving the same supernatural effect with CGI as opposed to art or animation, it is not often that a supernatural action-driven series is given the opportunity to be adapted into a live-action film. The original manga's appeal stemmed from its bizarre concept as well as the depth and stories of the characters who inhabit it. Assassination Classroom rose to the occasion, creating a film that worked with the bizarre premise of the story while remaining true to the manga's charm. Bakuman Mashiro Moritaka is a gifted artist who has never had the courage to pursue a career in drawing, since his uncle, a mangaka, died from overwork a few years ago. Takagi Akito, an inspiring writer, sees one of Mashiro's drawings and insists on collaborating on a manga. Mashiro remains hesitant until he learns that his crush, Azuki Miho, wants to be a voice actor. Their feelings for each other are mutual, so they make a promise to marry when they both achieve their goals. Bakuman is arguably one of the few manga that addresses the struggles and hard work that go into becoming and succeeding as a mangaka. The manga and anime adaptations are both fairly well known, but the live action adaptation is not. The Japanese Academy awarded it Best Editing, Best Music Score, and Most Popular Film in 2016, and it was nominated in numerous other categories. Death Note when Light Yagami, a 17-year-old high school student, discovers the Death Note, a book that kills whoever's name is written in it. He discovers that it was deliberately dropped into the human world by a sadistic god of death, named Ryuk. Recognizing the dangerous power that it had been bestowed upon him, Light begins to enact his own twisted sense of justice, with the ultimate goal of ridding the world of all evil. Detective L, the mastermind, is already on his tail, but it will be a battle of wits to see who comes out on top. In the anime community, Death Note is a household name, despite being outside of what is considered the big three in shonen anime. One Piece, Bleach, and Naruto, the series has a worldwide fanbase. The series' unique premise has left an indelible mark on the world of anime, but it's no surprise that no anime since has been able to achieve the same effect Death Note has, 
It should come as no surprise that a two-part live-action adaptation would perform similarly, with the first film topping the Japanese box office for two weeks after its release, and the second topping the charts for four weeks. That's it for today. Since you guys have reached here, I just want to remind you to subscribe so you will not miss any of our upcoming anime videos. Also, like the video as it helps us beat the YouTube algorithm and lets this topic be delivered to more people. And lastly, share this video so we can inform others. With that, thank you so much for watching, goodbye, and I'll see you in the next video.